is a, a third gen RAM. We're going to be tinting this third brake light on here. So we'll go ahead and remove this light. What we're going to need is a Phillips head. There's two screws on here. The screws are off. You should be able to just pop this light off of here. Uh, sometimes, being that it has a rubber gasket behind it, it does tend to get stuck to the cab. So you just got to pull on it. If you need to pry it with something, you can do that. Go ahead and disconnect this connector back here. So I had the third light removed from the truck's cab. Clean the light with uh, some glass cleaner and some clean rags. The clear lenses for the cargo, I like to keep those clear, so I'm going to go ahead and tape those off before we uh, spray the tint on this. So I went ahead and taped off the part of the lens I don't want painted or tinted. Uh, now at this time we'll take some wax and grease remover uh, with a clean rag and wipe it down one final time and then we'll go ahead and shoot it. Light is wiped down, it's nice and clean, there's no dirt, grease, wax, anything on it. Uh, we can go ahead and shoot it with our tint. What we're gonna, what we're gonna use is nightshades. Give this a, a first thin coat. So that's our first thin coat. We'll give it, uh, we'll give it five ten minutes to dry up, and uh, we'll see how it looks. If we want it darker, we'll give it another coat. Otherwise, you can leave it. Gave the light a second coat. I wanted it just a little bit darker. Uh, and I think I kind of like it the way it is now with the little red glow. I don't want it any darker, so I think I'll leave it at that. We'll let this set and dry for an hour or so. Um, and then uh, we'll put it back on the truck and see how it looks. Actually, we'll, we'll peel these uh, tapes off too, see how the clear lens looks on that. Um, at this point, if you want it darker, I guess you can spray another coat or two, however you like it. So I went ahead and removed the tape from the part of the lens I didn't want uh, tinted. We'll go ahead and put it back on the truck. The light back on the truck, I think it looks great. Just, just now, I'm gonna have to do the tail lights to match. Removed the, the tail lights also on the truck, and we're gonna go ahead and tint these also. So I taped uh, the clear part of the lens that I don't want tinted, just to match our uh, third light. Our first thin coat here. Okay, so I got one coat on them. We'll go ahead and uh, let these dry. And back on the truck, this is how they came out. I think they look pretty good, including our third light up there. With the tail lights on, 